delicious. We're inside the Golden Horseshoe and we are going to watch the Laughing Stock Show because it is going away as of September 15th. It will be gone for good. Hopefully people will say that's a bad choice and they'll bring it back, but I'm sure they have something great in store to take its place. of the Golden Horseshoe, Miss Rose, and the Honorable Mayor of Frontier Land, Sam McGillicuddy! Frontiers. 
golden queen. Yeah, I'm talking about that special lady. A lady I like to call my home, Frontierland. This lady's got a golden horseshoe and a shooting gallery. The sky's got a silver river. Far as the eye can see, she was built by man and critter. Living in harmony, that's why I love Frontierland. She's a little town for me. Frontierland, she's so, so peaceful. It's made of wood. <laughs> and that's what makes Frontierland a little time. And now we turn to all of you fine folks. And yeah, even that guy. Go ahead and sing along with us in the chorus. Oh, but Rose, if they're going to sing, they should do the choreography. Yeah. And it's really simple, everybody. It goes like this. Frontierland. Now, don't worry. As long as we're all doing it together, no one's going to look what's silly, all right? So here we go. Frontier. <laughs> I was completely wrong about that. <laughs> We're gonna do it anyways. In the spirit of the pageant, a five, six, seven, eight, frontier land. It's oh so peaceful. Frontier land. Well, that so tranquil. Frontier land. It's made of wood. And that's what makes frontier land a little town that could. And that's what makes frontier land a little town that could. Yeah, the hey, good, man. We certainly do. You guys were awesome. Hey, man, now would be a good time for me to do the speech I was talking about. Clint, now actually is a good time for you to grab the script that I wrote for you. And we're gonna begin on page one, everyone. Or on page one? No confusion now, because it's a, it's a, it's page one. <laughs> Front two. It began. It's a vast wilderness. With a beauty that only nature can deliver. From its big thunder mesa. To its long, scurvy river. That's curvy. It's a curvy river. <laughs> curvy river. It's that same long, curvy river that brought forth a legend to these parts. But he was a great man. A man who knew no fear. Who knew no fear? Or his cue for that matter. Oh, where could he be? Where could who be? Dr. Filler! The dentist? Yeah, he's playing the part. Well, I doubt the dentist is a man that knew no fear. <laughs> well, where is he? He's in jail. What? Yeah, I know he's supposed to be here, but I had to arrest him this morning. He was fighting out in the street, and that's why I thought I should do a speech. You know what, Clint? Give your sweet little speech. Oh, no, no, Rose, you said no speech of mine. No, I was talking to you, and I said no politicking. Hey, Rose, look, look. I'll handle this, all right? I'll handle it. We're gonna go with it. You see, it was the same long, curvy river that, that brought forth a legend to these parts. And he was a great man. He's a man who knew no fear. He's a man sitting right here. Come on, have a live on. Come on, Come on. Costume, hold on to that. Or a pork right there. Put it up top like a hat. Hey, doesn't that look good, y'all? There you go. Oh, yeah. Man, it looks great. All right, Evan, now don't you mess this up. <laughs> All right, now, along the rivers of America, Davy did row. Go and row your little boat. Don't make me do all the work, Edwin. There, there we go. There you go. Then he shout it out. Even for the A Lamo. No, it's uh, A All Lamo. It is just Alamo. Oh, okay, okay. He shouted out, remember the Alamo. So let's give that a shot. Ready? And. <laughs> Close to it. Yes, he does. He's That's what he did. <laughs> you shout out, remember the Alamo. All right? So, ready? Here we go. Ready? And. Yeah! 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 Baby, he was brave and strong. So show your muscles. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he could do no wrong. Yeah. Well, I think he proved that he could. But you know what? There was a legend of Davy Jones there and talking about how he once wrestled with the bar. Uh, Rawr! 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 Rawr!
Bam! It doesn't. I get hungry in a show. No. Davy wanted to build a town on this new land, so he asked our next legend to lend a hand. I said to lend a hand. Who's supposed to lend a hand? Nelson, the town manicurist. Oh, of course he is. He's supposed to be here, except I had to arrest him this morning. It was him that was fighting with Dr. Filler. Okay, stop, Clem, just stop. The dentist and the town manicures were fighting? Yep, they was going at it tooth and nail. Can you my seats now? Sure. Oh, no, I don't want you talking no more, actually. Oh, I do. I'm taking care of this one, too. You see, to build this town, much work needed to be done. So, Danny, he asked our next legend. I see you hiding back there. I need your help, Paul Bunyan. Come on up. Give this guy a big old round of applause as he makes his way on up to the stage. And let's find out who this is. What's your name? Rainier. Ruth, how about you here? Rainier. Rainier. Sorry, Rainier. Everybody say howdy, Rainier. He's gonna play the part of Paul Bunyan! Hey Paul! Hey Paul! Paul Bunyan! Paul Bunyan! Another guy from the audience! Alright, and here's your face, although you got this thing lit, but... <laughs> Rutherford's gonna play the part of Paul Bunyan with his big... Okay, big-ish blue box screen. Had some cutback, some galaxy thing, I don't know, okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right. Davey, Paul, and Babe, they worked day and night. Paul would chop! Chop a tree, Paul. Chop that tree. Chop that tree. Whoa! <laughs> he would actually chop with his face, his actual. <laughs> That's hardcore. Uh, uh, and uh, Davey was hammered. Clem? Uh, uh, Davey would hammer. And Babe would he be. And as each tree fell, he would yell out. What? No, Clint, he would yell out. Remember the animal. Yay, it's so great. And anyway, that was amazing. That was amazingly wrong, actually. <laughs> it's interesting. You're a lumberjack, right? You shout out Timber, all right? Let's give that a practice. Here we go, and... Timber. Yeah. Frontierland was built and all made of wood. I told you. Yeah. And the settlers moved in just as fast as they could. Thank you, Frontierland, we're done. No, 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 no. Well, there's more. Yeah, there's more. You see, quickly, our little town grew. A sad little town grew. You can huff and puff and say whatever you want, but ain't no one coming. Who are we waiting for now? That's the, the Pony Express writer. Yeah, well, she's supposed to be here, setting my You arrested her this morning. How did you know that? I, I had to. She jumped in the fight with Dr. Filler. I got this one. The Pony Express grew and the dentist got in a fight. A tooth in mail. No. Hoof and mouth. <laughs> Can I hear my speech now? Yes. No. No. Yes. Huh? Well, look, let me take care of this one too, all right? As I say, quickly, our little town grew. And amongst the famous residents was a legendary slew of shoes. You heard me go round the park. <laughs> Also from the audience. Alright, so right. here is a hat and a hairdo. <laughs> Alright, Lisa, here we go. Now, Slewfoot, she rode into town. Go ahead and ride your horse. Okay, there you go, yeah. Woo! Sound effects, that's good. Alright, she rode it. She rode it. Yes, you are. Uh, that's okay. Yeah, come on. Clem. Clem! Oh, hello. Sorry, I was enjoying the ride. Okay. <laughs> now she rode the town, all right? With plans to settle down. And as she rode, she, she twirled her lasso. There you go, yeah. And she would holler out. Geronimo. No cramps. She would holler out. Timber. Oh, she would holler out. Remember the Alamo. Yes, you are. Know, yes, you are. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. It's she, all right, Lisa, all right? She would holler out. Yippee I yay, yippee I yo. So here you go, ready? And. There yeah. you yeah. take the folks to their golden horseshoe can-can show! A five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven. Oh, yeah. 
This here, this is the finest entertainment that Disney has to offer. Yeah. The legends are doing a good job. Yes, they are. Now there's one more legend, a hero we all know. A person who did so much to help Frontierland grow. A great man and a friend to everybody. On election day, vote for... That's right, I'm your mayor and I plan to keep it that way, Maybe everybody. Maybe you yourself again, though. Hey, this is about the future for the future. This is not what we came out here to do at all. Now, give me just a second. Let me make some sense out of this. All right, folks, look. Frontierland is a lot more than just a town. It's a lot more than just my home. Frontierland is a feeling. And it's a feeling that you get whether you're new to town or whether you lived here your whole life. It's the same feeling when you sit with your family at supper. Or when you see a loved one heading up the trail toward you. Well, it makes you want to come together and work hard. To build a community where there truly are no strangers. So that way, no matter where you're from, Remember the animals. No matter what you do, Timber. You know when you come to Frontierland, you'll be greeted with a very warm, uh, yeah. And that is how you know Frontierland ain't just my home, it's all of our home. Come on, y'all. Right. Well, that was lovely. That was truly heartfelt. And you know what? There's not a lick of politicking in it. Let's hear for all the legends that help us out here today. Lisa and Sloop Country, Edwin and Davey Crockett, near his tall budget up. Big clothing number, a five, six, seven, eight. Frontierland, it's oh so peaceful. so we are usually not picked to be in the show. Today, however, we sat downstairs. Since the show is leaving, Bill really wanted to be able to sit up front and film the show. However, I got picked to be in it. It was really, really fun, actually. <laughs> I've watched it a ton of times, but to actually be in it was a totally different experience and amazing. 